Right now, this dog found abandoned with black tape around his muzzle and neck. The Australian Shepherd looking much better, as you can see now, but the person who abandoned that dog is still out there somewhere. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez live at Foothills Animal Shelter in Golden. And Lance, this dog was in pretty bad shape when he was found. Teresa, the man who found the dog said its mouth was swollen and it was very thirsty. Police telling us that whoever taped up the dog used black electrical tape like this. They also say that dog was microchipped, so there's a good chance they'll be able to find the owner. Man is the most cruel animal out there. Dr. Jorg Sumrock says he spotted a dog running loose near 75th and Knox Place just after 6 o'clock this morning. He noticed something shiny on its snout, then realized it was electrical tape. And my first instinct was, okay, let's get the tape off. He said the Australian Shepherd's face was swollen and smelly and that the dog was obviously dehydrated. So we got water for the dog and he basically chucked down two tops of water. I asked Westminster police why someone would tape a dog's mouth shut. It could be someone just fashioned it as a, a makeshift kind of harness muzzle. Uh, it could be that someone was intentionally trying to hurt the dog or someone just didn't realize that the dog wasn't able to drink or eat with this tape around its its muzzle. Investigator Sherry Spotkey says they don't know yet if the owner taped the dog or if the dog got loose and someone else did. Any thoughts about what should happen if they can find the person responsible? I'm not making those calls. Um, all I can say is the dog shouldn't go back. There's no reason why you would tape, you know, your dog's mouth. Now, police say it's possible that charges could be filed in this case, but they won't know what until they get to the bottom of what happened. That dog, eight years old, now being cared for here at the Foothills Animal Shelter in Golden. Authorities here say it is not for adoption. Reporting live in Golden, Lance Hernandez, 7 News.